Hello, this is Jeffrey Schultz here again today with a QuickBooks Pro tutorial. Um, I am Jeffrey Schultz and I am the managing partner for Schultz and Associates, an accounting firm in Plymouth, Michigan. Uh, I've been working with QuickBooks for almost 20 years or maybe longer than 20 years, almost since the very beginning the version came out anyway. So today we are going to be reviewing the accounts payable and then going into pay bills and paying the bill and we'll show you how to do that hopefully in just a couple of, uh, minutes of time so first of all, of all I already have QuickBooks open so I'm going to click on the, the QB down at the bottom here and I have my company my dummy company taxes are hard LLC open and ready to go uh, first thing I'm going to do is just uh, look at some reports here I'm going to click on reports and go down to vendors and payables in my favorite report when it comes to payables anyways the AP aging summary and you'll see that I uh, owe AT&T $1,492 um, also the year Columbus discovered America I guess um, and so um, let's assume for this exercise that that bill is due so uh, what we're going to do is, and, and, and remember, uh, as I've said before in other vi videos, that there are multiple ways to do things in QuickBooks. I'm going to show you one way. Uh, there are other ways. Um, I always go for efficiency and the quickest. Um, I also have been using it for 20 years, and some of the bells and whistles that they have available now weren't available 20 years ago. So uh, I'm a creature of habit and go with the old word bar up the top and use vendors. And the second one says pay bills. And lo and behold, I can show all bills here. It's clicked already for that. And you'll I'll see that the due date for my 18T bill is November 14th. So that's almost due here. And this is the invoice number, reference number, and here's the amount due. Um, I can click this and it will queue it up for payment and almost that easy what it's going to do now it's going it's going to create the check to pay this bill and move it into uh the checking account and it will show in the checking account that the check is ready to be cut and printed so though and those of you that are interested in the accounting terms basically what's going on here is I'm debiting the accounts payable for $1,492 and crediting the cash for $1,492. So pay select bills and refresh, sure, yes, and pay more bills. No, I'm done. You'll see now that my accounts payable aging that I report I left on the screen is still up there and it's no longer showing as due. If I go up to lists, chart of accounts, checking, I can see that my $1,492 uh, AT&T bill is listed there ready to be printed. So I could print it uh, whenever I'm ready to. That concludes the tutorial today of how to pay a bill in QuickBooks version 2016, although this applies to any version you're using, I'm sure. Um, if you have any if you're looking for more QuickBooks tutorials, you can find us find them at schultz-cpa.com.com. Again, that's schultz-cpa.com. Thank you.